Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Ignite With Me, where today we have the uh, Romeo and Julieta 1875 Nicaraguan. Okay. Um, so, this will be the end of the Romeo and Julietas as far as we telefine cigars Tuscaloosa. Next, we're going to jump into the Monte Cristo series. Okay. Now, I do have some Monte Cristo Espadas that I've already reviewed. Um, I'm gonna try to get into that as soon as possible. Excuse me a moment. Hi, sorry about that. The mail showed up and I needed to get that. I was expecting a package today. I got this Yayabo box online. I thought that was pretty cool. We don't have these at Vitola Fine Cigars, Tuscaloosa. I don't know that the other stores have them at all. Never heard of them. But I thought the box was cool. It has a lacquer finish to it. So I thought it was really neat. Wanted to give it uh, a go for my cigar box collection. So it's kind of like an off-white. Super cool. All right. <clears throat> Maybe you've heard of this one. Leave a comment in it. How What's it like? I can't necessarily get a hold of these uh anywhere you know tell me what you think about that one but at any rate let's get into this it's a smooth smoke there's a sweetness there that is something akin to like a graham cracker okay it's not a full-on graham cracker taste but I mean, it is, but it isn't. It's hard to explain. Um, it is sort of like graham crackers, but it's also sort of not like graham crackers. Some caramel taste notes and some spice on it. This is a pretty solid smoke. Yeah, for the price point on this, this is a fantastic scar. Um, maybe some coffee in there, maybe some coffee flavor notes. Either way, I think, you know, you would just, you know, I think you would be doing yourself a service to try this out. Come by be told to find cigars, Tuscaloosa, pick one of these up. Okay, it has a orange and white label. Check this out. Tell me what you think in the comment section below. I hope you have a great day and be blessed.